Yo! What's up, y'all? Greetings. Living my best life in Ghana. What's up with ya? Hope everyone is doing good. I'm doing great. Happy Africa Day to you. Happy Africa Day to all of us. It's a great time in the lives of us to be alive and to be African. And that's for real, for sure. So, Akwaba, Akwaba, welcome, 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 welcome to Living My Best Life in Ghana. I want to start off right now saying, Madase Pa. Thank y'all so much for the love and the support that's insurmountable. It's just awesome. Everybody is really just, it's, this is our time. I really feel like this is our time. I'm, I get excited by the day. It's like <laughs> every time I talk to anybody, any of us, you know, the family here, y'all just make me just smile. I mean, y'all the highlight of my day. Throughout the day when we not on the live, when we are on the live, all on the on the support group, all of that, I'm just loving all that we're doing for each other. It's very therapeutic. Yes, living my best life in Ghana family, uh, we are a a therapy family. We are full of therapeutic remedies and, and just the way that we speak with one another is so African and it's so true and it's so righteous. It's just Kweli. That means truth in Swahili. We are so Kweli. I mean, the truth is just here. It's not going anywhere. It, it can't be in disguise. It can't be, you know, it can't be hidden from us anymore. It's like we see through everything, everything. These folks be trying to come with, we be like, man, no, that ain't going to work on us no more. That is not going to work on us no more. It's not going to work. So y'all can come off that shit. Y'all can come off of it. <laughs> For real though, we ain't we ain't paying attention to that crap no more. We on a mission. And when once you got black folks on a mission, my goodness, it's just amazing how we really are focused when we are on a mission, when we know what we supposed to be doing, where we going. Hey, there ain't no doubt. What's up, y'all? What's up, everybody? Thank you so much for all the donations. Thank you for everybody that's been ordering the herbs. We own it. I want to let you know that these herbs are made with plenty of love and also through our most, man, honorable and the, the two doctors that we hold in high esteem that were African-centered, that knew the truth, that taught it to us as well as they could, and they got through to a lot of us. And that's Dr. Africa and Dr. Savy. And we are so glad and so proud to say that we are proud, proud students of our, uh, our ancestors, whether they're here on this earth or not, we always speaking what they taught and we send it and send it through packages, through the mail, through through the hands of people that want their body to heal itself through the assistance of our herbal remedies. And I'm so happy that you find it very important and prioritizing it in your life to make sure you have access to the herbs that we're supposed to use for our body. Now, there's some herbs that we're just not supposed to be privy to, and that's a lot of the herbs that come from China, a lot of the herbs that come from all of these places that don't have anything to do with our biological makeup. We have to be careful in what we use. Pick African herbs and, and Caribbean herbs or herbs that came from Africa that are here in different names. You know what I'm saying? Those are the herbs that we concentrate on in our combination pack. And if you need some, don't hesitate to go to webuyblack.com forward slash nappy, N-A-P-P-I, by nature. Okay? I want to say what's up to my fam up in here. Frank, 
Yo, greetings, Frank. What's up? What's up? Interesting. What's up with you? Malika said, interesting. Black family, I've been talking, taking my herbs, and I ain't never felt so alive and ready. <laughs> Medassi Pie didn't know where I was going or what to do. I found that light at the end of the tunnel. Thank you. Power to future and power. I know you are so welcome. You are so welcome, Malika. I tell you, I didn't even know you was about to say that. And I hadn't even read down the chat line. But hey, I'm following in the ways of our ancestors, the spirits of Dr. Sabi and Dr. Africa are on me right now. And look at you. You are even confirming what I said. Madasi Pa Malika, and we love you. Mwah. Thank you for that. I appreciate that confirmation. When you follow what the ancestor asked you to do, you just say it, you put it out there, and you'll be straight, okay? You'll be super straight. All right? Let's go with it. Shay said hugs all. What's up, Shay? What's up, my sister? What's up with you? Yes. Frank, Shay said, hi, and Frank, what's up? Yes, now I'm good. Say, hey, y'all. Hey, now I'm good. I'm straight. I'm okay. I'm good. Yo, lay, ho, Malika. I feel you. Hello, all of my beautiful sisters and magnificent brothers. What a great day to be African like Future always says. Yes, it is. Yes, it is, Yoli. I swear it is. I wouldn't take it for nothing. I don't care what the offer is. You will never be able to buy my blackness, my Africanness. The white said, Hey, greetings, the white. What's up? Talk to our brother today. What's up with you, the white? Hey, what's up, fam? Rake in the house. Rake. What's up, sis? Hope you are doing great. I'm loving the energy with them babies. And y'all get ready to come to Africa with us. We all gonna be straight. Y'all hear me? We are going to be straight. Yes, Sango Tumbe. Greetings, y'all. Denwaro. It means hello from the Kasim people in the northern part of Ghana. All right. Thank y'all so much. Madase Pa. Yes. Sherry said, hey, 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 family. Hey, everybody. We ain't worried about nothing. Akuta Matata. Okay. STJ. Hey, y'all. Hey, STJ. Greetings. How are you? How are you? Hope everyone is doing great. I saw your email today. Hey, just looking good. Just great feeling the vibes of all our people that's been communicating uh, in the everyday life. We love y'all. Thank you so much for everything you're doing. Hope you're fine, Shay. I'm about to go to work soon. Yeah, Frank, we know you worked at that... Uh, that shift, baby. That's the shift. I know the time is different here from there. So I know it's early in the morning where you are. Gonna likes. Ah! Hey, gonna likes. What's up, sis? What's up with you? Hope everyone is doing great. Hope you feeling fine. Hope you feeling the best African you can be. Hey, Kenny Fields in the house. What's up in the field if you will? What's up with you? Hey, Kenny, greetings. Power said he tried to call you. He tried to call you a couple of times today. Get up with him. T. Roy said, big stupid love, future and family. <laughs> you know you better say it, T. Roy. I like the new picture. You got a new picture for us. T. Roy to change his profile picture, pal. Oh, he yeah, he soldiered up some more. He just soldiered up a little bit more on us. Yo, Sherry said, I mean, the white said, Sherry, Trini, Gal, San Fernando, Marabella, Lavental, Trin City. This brother here, this man is versed on them areas. <laughs> the white said, thanks for the butter. No more dry feet. 
You so welcome, my brother. I'm glad that I could do it for you. Any of my other folks need a little shea butter in your life, don't hesitate to email your girl, okay? Because that's not on the, everything that I have is just not on We By Black yet. But if you have a question or anything that you might need and I can provide, I can send it straight to you. And you just hit me up on the cash app all day. All right. Quanita said, greetings, family. What's up, Quanita? Hope you feeling good, sister. All right. We on our way around here. Stay focused. We got this. I like it. That's right. That's right. That's what it's all about. It's about focusivity. Focusivity. Come on with these words, future. I got something for y'all. Focusivity. It's all about focusivity and living my best life in Ghana, okay? We are truly that. We are truly that. Shay is saying hey to single Tumbi. Yo, China Ers that we are we get aren't real. They are bleach. That's why we got to stay away from these Wuhan carriers. All right. Greetings and blessings, family in Missouri in the house. Jackie, yo, what's up with you? Thank you for this, Shay. Appreciate you. Mm hmm. The white, I'm not Trini. My adopted family are from Trinidad. See, get it right, the white. Get it right. Y'all make sure y'all like, subscribe, share, comment, notify, get notified, all of that good stuff. We love our people over here. Come on up in here. Come on in the room. My joy, everyone. Hope y'all are all living your best life and walking in truth. Yes. That's truly African-centered. When you are African-centered, you don't let anything veer you from walking in quali, quali, truth, okay? Totally. Thank you, baby. Need some nice water on the scene. Yes. That's about 10.30. I have to cease water. So you won't, if you don't want to go to, to the toilet all night through the night, waking up at your sleep to go to the toilet, try not to drink a little water after 1030. That's what, uh, who said that? Dr. Africa. Try not to drink water after 1030. Try not to. And you, that'll cut down on your disturbing your rest and, and making your, your body functioning in a, another manner while you're sleeping. Okay. So, come on, get them lights up, y'all. Get them up. Get them up, get them up, get them up. Yes. All right, here. Let's keep it moving. Malcolm X. Xavier, how are you? Hey, y'all. What's up, fam? What's up with y'all? Hope you feeling fine. Hope you doing great, my brother. Good to have you here. Power just walked in the building. What's up, peeps? What's up? What's up? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Everybody Hi, speaking to one another. Hi, Joe. Mm -hmm. Yo. That's right. Everybody. You say Troy got a new, uh, what's it called? Picture? Profile, profile picture. picture, yeah. Honeybee Beauty. Hey, honey, be beauty. Honey you saw be that. Hey, fam. Hey, <laughs> sweetie pie. How you doing? Much love to all my young empresses, all of our queens on here, all of our kings on here, and our emperors. We love y'all. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Aquaba. I hope you feeling as excellent African self today, no matter what our trials and tribulations, no matter what our struggle is. When we come together as one and unify, we can kill all the negativity, all the evil stereotypes about African people, about our culture, our rituals, our heritage. We can tell the truth, truth today. Quay Lee, 
We want the truth to be revealed at all times when it comes to us so we can get back to our humility. We can get back to being the best. Uh, that's why we were the first people on this earth because we are so naturally in sync with the earth. Mm -hmm. Okay, period, point blank. It ain't no question about it. That's all these Johnny come lately is, is messing up everything. Right, Casey, I'm ready for some food at Troy. <laughs> Wait a sure minute. Got that, got that, uh, that jambalaya recipe. <laughs> okay. I forgot about that. <laughs> you ain't forget? Not. Come on, focusivity. <laughs> focusivity. Focusivity. I like how you spelled it too. <laughs> put that on the shirt. Yep. We all about that focusivity. Infinite Mama Folk, greetings family, started a little pack in the day. I'm just so excited. Thanks again for all the motivation and the inspiration. Go ahead, Infinite Mama. You phone. better go and do it then. Bump your little bit like Keisha Brown while you packing. Next time you start putting stuff in the box, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Open your windows. Yeah. Burn some sage. Let the sun in while you pack. Tell her, baby. Let all the windows up. T-Roy! T-Roy! <laughs> Hold you on, man. Him? Hold on, man. You got, ah, he got the chill. He got the chill. See it all. He got his chill hey, drawers in. Chill Troy. Man. Don't play with him, man. Focus and positivity. <laughs> yes, focusivity. I yes, like that, Shay. <laughs> Look, yeah. any of my brothers out there, Kenny, I heard you was in. I want to put you, if you don't already know, put y'all up on the best Black on underwear for men in the world. Champs boxers. Ch Champs, you gotta call them draws. We can't yeah, say boxers. Got... Champ Champs draws. Man, what I'm telling you is the best underwear in the world for me. They got mud cloth. Yeah. They got and the fit. I'm talking about hey man. I love the draws. I do. I love draws. See? Quanita, feeling great. My husband decided he's going to drink herbs with me every day. Finally got my husband on board with me. Looks like it will be gone to 2021 for us. See, we told you, Quanita. See, I told you. Mwah. I'm I proud of you, Quanita. You stayed on them. You was nice and you was patient. This is African. This is the African way. Showing patience, being humble, pushing the point. But not forceful, okay? Being sweet. Like, you know how women have it. We, we got it where we can be real sweet to the mind. You know what I'm saying? Put that thing down. <laughs> oh, man. Dwight said, for your information, Brussels is running flights to West Africa, starting with Monrovia, Liberia, and Freetown. You will have to quarantine for a minimum of 14 days. So if you plan on making the trip soon, expect to stay. And I would love to do it. You're not ready, fam. LOL. This that knock your socks off. Woo, pow, pow. We ready for it, <laughs> T-Roy. We are. I'm talking about. <laughs> T-Roy, don't play with him. He's a sheriff said, Dwight, are they making you self-quarantine or do they have to say you have to stay in a government facility. That's a good question. Becoming Brandy. Hey, yeah. Becoming Brandy. Hey, Becoming Brandy in the house, y'all. Salute, OG Power, LOL. Another day, another dollar, man. Take care of your business, bye. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, share it. So, hey, cousin. Becoming Brandy. Mito, Mito. Yo, What's up? Mito, Mito. From the Bronx around this John. Hey, family, did you guys see? Oh, did we yet. see we it? We saw that today. Oh, we were so inspired. Just saw the water we had bike already channel. said hey. something about the activated charcoal, so that was just confirmation. Me though, did you see the man rub the charcoal on his white shirt and didn't nothing come off on his shirt? Clean charcoal. It sure was inspired, me though. Oh, you been man. if y'all didn't see it, go watch check it. Out. Check that out. It's on Walter Myers channel. Yes, Zako. Company in Ghana. It's a charcoal active. It's a charcoal company. Yes. For burning and cooking and stuff with, but it's made out of coconut shells. And he's shipping worldwide and too. He's shipping worldwide. We all need to make an order and buy us a bag of that charcoal. The Warden Meyer said he want a hundred thousand orders. 
And I think I won't be one of them 1,000. 100,000. Yes, we yeah, are. Check that out. Power! D White, what's up, home? Oh! What's up with you? The White is happy. He got his, uh, his shea butter. Oh, you today. got your butter, man? Mm -hmm. I just put me some on my face. I'm feeling light as a bunny rabbit right now. Man, my <laughs> it's a bunny rabbit. Bunny Chase rabbit said, like, Virtual! Shea, oh! Yeah! <laughs> Play with it, yeah, yes. Carnita is winning. Queen Nomad in the house. Hey, fam, I got my fix of home, Mississippi, <laughs> Tennessee. When I watch y'all, <laughs> that's right. <laughs> you better know it. That's right, Queen Nomad. Straight up, straight up. What's up with you, sis? Hope you are doing great. We just feeling our best African self right now because we know that the plan is already working. And we work in the plan, ain't it, baby? Sure, yeah. <laughs> the white said, Quanita, so happy for you. I can't wait to see the results of your detox. And I pray your ailments go away. Oh, yeah. You better speak oh, that, Dwight. That's what I'm talking yeah. about. Yeah. That's how we had to do for each other, y'all. Yeah, that's it. Because we be going through stuff in our own little, little areas. Now that extra energy be thinking about folks, it go a long way. Go a long way. Yo, let my youngest son, who is a college, agreed to go with us when we visit Ghana next year. I just know once he steps onto Mother Africa, he will understand how important this journey is. Baby, yo, yo let me tell you you're going to melt when you get to Africa and your tell son you. get there. I'm telling you. It's a life changing experience. My son went there and he did not come back home for six months. And we were only supposed, when he went, he was only supposed to be there like 30 days. No, we were supposed to be moving. That's when all that stuff happened with the situation with the girl at the Oh, show. show did. Yeah, that's yeah, right. We ended moved. up having to leave. Sold stuff and everything. Oh, that's liquidated. true. That's right. That's when Broke we out. first moved to Ghana. Yes. Man. Yeah, we need to tell that story. Sorry, I was thinking, have we ever told that story? We have not. We never told that story. We got to wow. tell that story. That's when we, when we sold everything while we was in the house we was okay, in. Okay, so we what? Well, stuff. We wanna, you want to tell it tomorrow? We can. It's cool. Yeah, power to made us think that's we got so many stories y'all do not believe, but that is another story that we going to have to tell y'all tomorrow, okay? Since we already got our thing going on over here, we're going to talk about speaking the language and how and how you are so accepted and yeah, make your, your African family feel good to know that you really trying to learn the language oh. and communicate with your African tongue. Oh. Then I'm telling you, I'm telling you, let me put your little cool points and I'm going to sprinkle a little cool point in there right quick. So when you start learning your little phrases, right? And you be in line, maybe in the market or something like that. And you know, oh, you know how sometimes you just kind of have a little conversation with yourself. I'm not crazy. I'm just saying you just have a little conversation with yourself. <laughs> it's all right. You, you speak a little out. tweet outside. <laughs> what? <laughs> you, <laughs> well, you speak you're a little Scorpio, tweet outside. Y'all have a lot of voices going on in your head all the time. You don't never slow down. I want you to slow it down. <laughs> Oh, but when they hear you speak a tree, just in common phrases, it's like, oh, he's not crazy man. though. I can agree. It's like, oh man, Virginia Harris said hello from California. What's up, Virginia? Virginia, up, Virginia? yo, y'all, let me tell y'all now. I know I told y'all this yesterday, but if you want your teeth white. And you don't want no stains or nothing on your teeth, get you some activated charcoal. We sell that too, by the way. If you need you a nice dose, I got a nice little container with that you can take them with you wherever you go. When you go out of town, everything. It's a nice so little sign of some, some, some. Where is Al? You wanna get it for me? Is it one right there? Activate charcoal. We got it so many places. Is that one? You get the one in the uh so I can show our folks what it looked like, but you brush your teeth with it every day for two minutes. When I tell you, I don't care how long you ain't seen white teeth, it's gonna turn them teeth white. The more you brush with it, the faster it get down to that pretty, pretty pearly white, okay? Champ boxes, you better put it up there. 
Them the best draws I ever seen. There's a man, some black man draws right there. Oh, Troy said, I spent about $200 on draws. I got the flip flops, the mud cloth t shirt, and everything else. <laughs> Hold on, man. You said flip flops? I got the T. I got two T shirts. Yeah. Cause I, I bumped into him at We Buy Black. We we met the owners. Yeah. The and owners. He, he came. He threw me a couple T shirts. And his mama. Yeah. And his mama. They and was like, this man really love how I'm like, lady, you just don't understand. <laughs> like, mama. She was like, y'all come on, take a picture. Yeah. Y'all come on, do this. Y'all come on. We love y'all. They was like, y'all some cool yeah, folks. I Look. It with them people. So boy. did. <laughs> Yes, anyone go to Tanzania? Yeah, they are open to us too. Not sure how long we have to quarantine for. Yeah, uh, that's what I'm trying. We to just do. had somebody talk about that. This is what our activated charcoal comes in. You see this little small? This thing lasts too. It's like a old cookie jar. I don't know if you can see that. <laughs> uh, this is what the activated charcoal comes in. And it's excellent for your teeth. Uh, if you have a stomach ache or something, if you have a uh what you call it, a hangover, mm -hmm. activated charcoal go in there and expands and get rid of all the toxin out of your body. It's a binder. It, yes, it's a very good binder of toxic. If a mama folks <laughs> That face no power, like you don't know about that sweetness that Queen got you caught up with. <laughs> the LOL. He know. He know. That's what got him the first date. Me, I snatched him up. up. <laughs> Unexposed experience. Hey, What's up, What's up, Sandra. What's up, How you doing, my love? Greetings. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And I got your number. Wanna call you tomorrow. I need to bring y'all here. I got to bring y'all here real soon. Yes. The white said, power up. Hey, white, what's up, man? <laughs> what's up with you? Oh, what up, man? You are going to Rome. No. Oh. If you fly Brussels, please go as a large group. Check Blacks it. Oh, Lord. Thank you, Shay. Yeah. Website for the charcoal, please. <laughs> you can just send me an email, living my best life in Ghana at gmail.com, and we can handle the rest, love. Honey, be beauty. And Troy, you so <laughs> extra. Troy said, Oh, that threw me out. I was like, Charcoal, no dirty shirt, LOL. Shit. <laughs> the main room, the junk. He got a, I'm talking about a, a pure white shirt. Bing, white shirt, T Roy. He took the charcoal brick and rubbed that junk on his shirt, man. Didn't nothing no, come out. Nothing, up. not at all. I didn't even know that was possible. <laughs> Family. Hey, Nisa Boo, what's, what's up, up with you? Tariq, dear. Columbus. Oh, Tariq, what's up? Yo, what's up? What's up? We got a new person Tariq dear, from Columbus, Ohio. Yeah, what's up, up with you? Welcome, Aquaba. Columbus in the house, y'all. Shamariah say, Hey, greetings, y'all. And yes, I was lurking to see if y'all was live, fam. Had a rough day, but soon as I heard Miss Future Child, I got a big old Kodak smile on my face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Shamariah, much love to you, love. And welcome back. Glad you here. And what's the live of my best life and gonna live without you? We need all our people here. So y'all just come on in here and make yourself comfortable. Carnita <laughs> <laughs> said at the white, yes, my daughter makes sure she snaps a picture every week starting last week. And Malika Muhammad sent me some videos to work out too. We'll see what happens. Fingers crossed. Oh, you are you already. Yeah, you got that, yeah, Carnita. It's over with. <laughs> yeah, you got that. It's over with. You're gonna see so many inches fall off, it's gonna blow your mind, honey. Zako featured on Water Mike. Yeah, that's yeah it. that was a beautiful. When I tell Man. you that brother was so sincere and open. Yeah, he was. It was amazing to see somebody not trying to cut corners, just opening up themselves and telling their story. You know what I'm saying? That's a part of 
the disseminating of information. You have to be truthful. That's what I'm talking about. The truth must, you know, it must surface. Okay. So this is something that is very inspirational. Y'all make sure y'all go and watch that video, share it with others, and order your bag of charcoal, okay? Troy said, I'm just passionate African. And she, LOL, I don't hold back but a little bit. <laughs> you ain't got to around here. The wife said, for those who don't know, Power is an accomplished rapper. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, three white man. Appreciate it, my bro. <laughs> yes, he is. If you want to power music, we still hey, we doing the old school. We got them CDs because we got a whole <laughs> spirit that comes along with our right, music right. that we want you to experience. So digital is cool sometimes, but if you hold on to your DVD player to play CDs or your portable CD player or a CD player in the old car, or old SUV or something. Retro CD slinging retro, out the truck. Yeah, trunk. we still slinging <laughs> CDs, you know what I'm saying? Retro. So if you want one, <laughs> live in my saying? best life and gone at Gmail, and we'll go from there. I want you to get your get our music in your hands. You'll be proud of us. We really put a, a lot of love and power into our music, too. Yeah, it's, it's really nice. Hey, Queen Shamarai said, can you give me the link to that men's underwear? Because my C and B is shifting. <laughs> God, oh, lead the way. <laughs> oh, hey, bro, I feel It's Champs and Boxers. Perfect, man, the Champs Boxers. Oh, uh, Shay had put it in here. She going to put it in there again. Bro, yeah, that's too you, funny. The best drawers in the world. You, you ain't got so to worry straight. about no shifting. They hold I'm them tight. Right now. Wow. You going to be in there. <laughs> <laughs> I put Tell them dress on. The I put them in the shorts. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be like, where you going? Where you think you going? Uh, yeah, put you some shorts on, brother. Serious. <laughs> serious. I'm just waiting for you guys to finish one story, just <laughs> one. <laughs> I be trying to. She be telling me, "No, baby, we got to do a whole show on that, baby. We got to." <laughs> yeah, oh, hey, we got to keep the anticipation up, Sherry. <laughs> Sherry, <laughs> we Mr. love Sherry, our folks. We like it. Cut the out. Oh man, twenty six watching, forty one. I mean, twenty six likes, forty one watching. Come on, y'all. What's up with y'all with them likes? Come on, thumb us up. Come on, baby, put your thumb up. <laughs> so slow. Come on with it. Yeah. You got to think before you put your thumb up too. Yeah, I had to make sure I get it frank. If I go this way, you can't see it. It's <laughs> too much yeah, thinking. Yeah, Just yeah. put the damn thumb up over here, pal. <laughs> see, that's you I'll be telling me about Scorpio. <laughs> we think we think Troy, about I bet <laughs> I hear you. I'm a Leo extra should be my middle name. <laughs> Oh, yes, Leo. Yes, sir. Y'all just like them Scorpios. Y'all come with it like that, too. <laughs> Ellie. Ellie, the king and queen are back again, spreading the love and positivity. Yes, man. We hey, here. Ellie, I What's like up? your profile. What is that? So cutie. Look at that. The older I get, more I realize I have a little tolerance for drama, conflict, and stress. I want to be around happy people doing my best. I guess it said something. I couldn't see it because of the YouTube, but I just made it. You but that's that's great. I love that, that's Ellie. Real. Great, <clears throat> great job. Mm -hmm. How long does it take to work? How long does what take to work? What we done talk? We done talked about <laughs> so much. Come on with it. What, what we talking about? Let's go with it. <laughs> Thanks. Sugar shades, Sherry <laughs> shades, Shay Sherry. <laughs> that charcoal. Oh, how long does it take that charcoal to work? It just depends on how much damage, but you'll see res you'll see results immediately. Oh, yeah, yes, so just use it, use it, use it, brush with it. That's why I say at least two minutes. But the more you brush daily, sometimes I brush three times a day. It just depends on what I eat. Because I don't want nothing sticking to these pearly whites. <laughs> so I do charcoal it is sometimes three times a day, but at least twice when I get up before I go to bed. Okay? <laughs> it said get rid of stink, too. 
So, <laughs> what? Take- that, charcoal, that charcoal get rid of a stank tooth, too. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You, know, you can take some, if you're having a toothache, immediate pain, mm-hmm. you take your nice little scoop of that charcoal and put it right directly on that tooth and that gum. I'm telling you, it pull that pain, it just, it just pull that pain right down right quick. And clove, too, if you're having tooth pains. You know, because most times, teeth, toothache hit you in the middle of the night. Oh, yes. And ain't After no everything you get closed. To. Man, yes, look, it's true. Keep you some clove oil, clove bud oil. Yes. Yeah, to knock that too. It'll get and you. And if you, you got know, the clove seasoning and your tooth gets to ache, make right. you some clove tea. Right. Make sure you got clove with you in Ghana. Ghana has clove. Now, that's Strong one thing you can find. <laughs> some clove. Oh, my God. That is a beautiful remedy for pain. You bite down one of them, the whole tip of your tongue go numb. You talking about a natural anesthesia? Clove. Clove. Okay. Uh, now I'm good. Said outside of learning tree starting this Saturday. I want to learn Creole and Creole, different variations of Creole and Swahili. That'll be the absolute next. I find our ancestral language to be so beautiful. They are. They and they are really too. are, and they make you very strong too. They make you very strong. You have a sense of, of power when you speak your uh, native tongue. For those who are worried about going home, the first comment that is made at customs is welcome home. <laughs> God, the way you better say that. Now I'm good, so I currently understand French, Spanish, and Curtis. Kurdish. Not great at speaking yeah. it back, though. Yeah. Gone now, I'm good. That's how I am with Spanish. I use the activated charcoal to brush a couple of times a week. The other days, I use coconut oil for uh, my teeth. Be smooth and smooth. Yeah, them like you be. Yeah. You hit them joints. What's the draws y'all talking about? Champs. <laughs> Me too. Oh, Champs. Champs. Gotta get them. Champsboxers.com. Yes, sir. Check them out. I'm about to email y'all for that charcoal because I only got about a week left. Bet. T Roy. Bet. T Roy been the goat. Do you use that Back only to up. brush your teeth or just fluoride as well? Oh, oh no, we don't use no fluoride. fluoride. Oh. That takes off your natural enamel on your teeth. So don't don't follow that fluoride thing. That's that's for them white folks. The wife said, I found a little restaurant on Old National that sold cassava leaves and rice. It was good. What? What? Old National. That's a, that's, I know that's in Georgia. I know it's Atlanta. I'm talking about Old National. I don't, well, we've been on, we've been on that street too. Uh-huh. <clears throat> Look, now I'm good. Say, LOL, y'all so cute. Look <laughs> 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 that said. She said, it's thank you. Yeah, it's thank you. <laughs> oh. Power couple for real. <laughs> <laughs> and Dwight DeMilton, my brother, dated a girl from St. Louis, and she taught me how to make cassava stew. Oh. Uh-huh. That's Sierra Leone? Yeah, it's here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Man, I be turning that stuff up. That's what's up. I said St. Louis. Yeah, cassava stew? Right. In St. Louis. I mean, it might have been some girl from some Sierra Leone. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Yes. Girl, what you doing up? I'm just teaching the brother how to make it. Yourself, L, baby, 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 baby. We called you today. So did, bro. <laughs> Where you at? And emailed you too. <laughs> Call us back. Greetings, fam. I almost miss y'all. <laughs> better not. Y'all better come on up in here. Put them thumbs up on the way. Come on in here, family. Welcome, Aquaba, to all the newbies. Welcome to the family. Yeah. That's true. Hey, you and Shawnee Stewart. How you doing, family? Raquel, right, my son, he'll meet the charcoal, but I didn't know it had multiple uses. Yes, ma'am. Yes, it does. Look, even if you get like a uh, food poisoning, even if you had to take char- yes. activated charcoal, will act as a binder for the poison. Your blood bind up so you can pass it out through your waist. Yes, and that and, happened for me. I, I'm saying I'm speaking out of uh, experience because it happened to me at Lake Balsam Tree one time. I got hold of some food that they had just took the meat out of it, and it told me up. I'm, I, was, I was told back about eight, nine days off the top. Mm-hmm. But they activated charcoal. It was binding it down, pulling it out of my system. I was passing. I gradually felt myself getting better. Mm-hmm. Another thing, when we was... This last time we was in Ghana, 
And we were, you know, the sister that was living up under us. She drank some bleach oh, by mistake. Man. Oh, she drank some bleach tragic. by mistake. This lady drank some bleach by mistake. And and I took him and I saved her life. He went and got hey. some palm oil. Yeah. Made her drink a whole lot of it. And she threw all that bleach up and she did not lay on her back or nothing. This lady survived. She just put a bottle back that she thought was water. Right. And it was in the it refrigerator. It was in the refrigerator. She found out later on that somebody was trying to do it in. But what happened was she drunk it and she screamed. I too was down there where she was. He came in and she she screamed out. She drunk the bleach. She drunk it and he ran and came up to me, upstairs to me. He was like, Mommy, I need the palm oil. I need the palm oil. I give him the palm oil. He take it. He make her drink it. And when I tell you, the lady threw up everything in her body. <laughs> everything in her body. Yeah. She ain't had to go to the hospital or anything. So if you have uh, the children with you, something happened where they make a mistake and they drink something poisonous, get your hand on some of that gunner red palm oil and shove it down their throat. Okay? It's gonna come it's up. gonna come up and it's gonna coat their stomach really well, and you won't have no problem. Yes. Yes, I'm Peace Family. How are you at Troy? How are you doing, Sister Quanita Mbrake said? You're welcome. You ain't trying. We, You ain't trying. We doing this. You got this. Yes, you got it. I'm wonderful at Shawnee. Thanks for asking, Troy said. Michawo, Michawo family. Keisha. What's up with you? Yo, what's up, Keish? Keish. Quanita said, Raquel, I'm doing great. How about yourself? At work and just got a breather. There you go. We always right on time. I ain't with Keish, Keish. Yes, love to hear it at Troy. Hey, Keisha, sister. Okay, I'm going to need everybody in the chat room where everybody in 2021, when we had the first. Living my Black best life. Fist Kung Fu class in 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 Ghana. Uh -huh. I need everybody to be in attendance with your red t-shirts on and your black pants. And, and we're your, gonna get down. And your green tennis shoes. Ooh, I need to have some little black little slippers made to put on with the, oh. You can get some, you can get one of the brothers and make you That's some what nice, I'm about. nice Kung Fu green. Oh, yeah, Kung we're gonna Fu have shoes. this gonna be the cold. I'm talking about I'm trying to look. Oh hey. Mm -hmm. Then I'm gonna have my I'm gonna have my teacher come. Then I know I can have my grandmaster come because I know he'd be down. Master Lee is down. That's a cold brother, Master Andrew Lee in Chicago. Wow. Yeah, Keisha said, y'all, my speed, still slanging CDs, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> CDs, man. We better know it. We got a special <laughs> feel to them CDs. It's a lot of work went, in them, went to them CDs and in them CDs to be going straight digital and not, give, not making sure you get that power in your hand, for sure, for sure. Yes. I said, pray for Quan. Quanita. Quanita. Making your own activate charcoal is easy per these YouTube videos. Yes, it is. And we plan on doing some of that too. K and K TV. What up, what up, what up, what up? Hey, Kate, Kate. Scorpios in the house. Yes, yes, yes. 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 Yes, yes,
throughout <laughs> saying it'd be funny. Hey, you be uh, wondering what is what is he talking about? Like, Pop, I be with you, but I missed that one that time, man. Come. Keisha said, when I worked as a school nurse, I used to put cloth powder on kids' teeth. Uh -huh. Yep, that's good for the teeth, too. It's good for your gums, teeth, get rid of any. Just for people with halitosis and all of that kind of stuff, clove bud oil. Yes, clove bud, I mean. Clove, you can make your own tincture. All you got to do is crush the uh, cloves up. Boil you some water, turn it off, and pour your clove in there and let it sit as strong as you want it. The more clove oil you put in there, but you can make you some nice numbing oil, some nice numbing tincture, and something for a, a virus, by antivirus, antibacteria. Clove stay in my house, medicine cabinet. Yes, that's right, Keish. Fluoride is just. Pure poison. It sure is. Yes, it is. Wormwood, clove, <laughs> and black walnut blend is a natural antiviral and will kill parasites. Got to have all three together, though. And I sure got Tell that in my that uh, fight wood, back combo. Wormwood ain't nothing no to play with. Joke. Yourself, L. Bay, 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 bay. Snap. Baby. <laughs> Atlanta, South Fulton County. Uh huh. Keisha. For those who don't know their history, a common meal in Brazil is called caldo verde, which is collard green soup. It's just an ocean away. Ooh, that sounds so good. Oh, we. Where we going, Dwight? Let's Dwight, go. Meet jump. Me over there, let's man. jump let's, on it. Let's go ahead and meet jump me and go. Over there. Come on, let's go. And jump. Let's it. go taste <laughs> the collard green soup, bro. Why's collard green soup sounds bum? It's man, don't you better good. know. No, I'm good. It's just like them damn Katumbre greens Katumbre in stew. Ghana. Just you. like that Katumbre stew in Ghana. Because look, I'm telling you, when I started, first started making palava sauce, when I learned the recipe, when I would come back to the States, I was using spinach. Which, you know, if you cook spinach too long or let it get too yeah. hot, it wilt and get real soft and mushy. So I was like, it's cool to give me the experience. No, like, I'm, the one one that, I, I'm the one. I'm the one. Now give me my give my props, pal. Give me my props. I'm just gonna see if you're gonna do it. Keep going with the story. I don't know what you're talking about. Wait what? a minute. Let me take this out of the screen. And look at him. What? What props are you talking about for trying the collard greens? Yeah. Yes. 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 I am talking about the collard greens. Who told you to try collard greens? It. You said something about the collard. Okay. I think I remember. Uh, yeah, my wife said, you ought to try collard greens, baby. Then I thought about it, I was like. You said, oh, it might be a little it too might be tough. too strong. And I said, because you know, collard greens got a little strong flavor. But I then said, I no, thought they're going to be I good because oh. like the katumbre greens is pretty. Yeah, because you had to, I thought it was because you had to cook that katumbre. Because if you don't cook katumbre good and you eat it, it make your tongue itch. <laughs> Uncle T taught us that. So I was like, it might be the same thing. So, but collard greens, perfect. Perfect. Richard Prempe, hey you oh, all, oh. Mahutisan, yo, hey, 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 hey. No, so, hey. Richard, yo, Charlie, oh. I make strawberry lemonade with activated charcoal. You better oh, do man. it, T Roy. T Roy, you showing out, man? How you got? <laughs> you got activated charcoal in the lemonade? Yeah, you know oh, we had some activated so charcoal false. lemonade before, but we ain't had strawberry in it. But that's that's boss, that's boss right, right, there, right there. We got to bring some strawberry seeds. To Ghana. Now, that's one thing I love a lot, but I don't see in Ghana is some strawberries. Call so, anybody want to make onyx. some strawberry farms, come on with it. Some strawberry, strawberry gardens. The strawberry onyx juice. Oh, I like it, baby. Yeah, you serve that in a clear, something clear where you can, they can see that little charcoal swooping around in there with the strawberry in the thing. How you got to do it? If you could have a gold somewhere, you could have a gold ice cube or something like that. And there's some Africans that come up with a gold ice cube. I ain't talking about from the mineral gold, from some kind of fruit or something. You can form a gold. I have they put faith. a little turmeric in there. It'll kind of look like gold, a little like gold, gold, gold strips. You know what I'm talking about? The I white seen somebody fix a fuse so everything's possible to me. The white dementia said, 
for your information, the quality food in this country has gone down with the coronavirus. Be proactive. Do not eat any fish until you get to Africa. Yes, sir. Now, that's the I truth. I that motion right there. That's the truth because it has even, corona has even stopped the import of all of that foreign fish from China in Africa. Sure have. And sure a lot are. of people are eating the local fish sure again. Sure are. Sure are. So that's a plus. It and sure now that is. they have stopped, sure we should is. stop them permanently. Hello to so our leaders. Oceans can replenish themselves. Yes. They do not, they are not in harmony with nature. Like that's <clears throat> African people are. Like that's, we are. that's one thing that we found out about the fishermen. The fishermen have a protocol and a ritual that's done on a regular basis in ghana every tuesday every tuesday you leave you do not touch you do not fish you give mommy water a chance to replenish the ocean herself of her natural marine children okay but i like that wonderful so i like that wonderful marine children because there's mommy water Mom water, mommy yeah. water got I love her water. children and say in there I'm too now. I'm one of my love the water. So that's what Ghana, the fishermen, they are very respectful and humble you on their day. I'm a water son. Mm -hmm. I got hip to that, baby. Dwight, you know about that song right there? That song, that was a parliament in Funkadelic. I can't remember, you know, that song. Title of the song used to be about this long. So I can't remember the name of something, but it was on the album. I'm going to find out. Dag, everything is trash now in terms of food. Best to grow your own. It's sure true. Is. It sure is. That's good to know about the palm oil. Yes, ma'am. I'm serious. Mm -hmm. You know we had the same name. Salute at Troy Joseph. <laughs> Well, I need to say after my husband watched the YouTube videos of the Nigerian cooking jollof rice for his roommate and seeing his hilarious reaction. Now he want to go try some <laughs> jollof rice. <laughs> Yay! Go, man. I'm telling you, jollof rice is going to change your life. I'm telling you, bro. You be like, man, why we ain't been cooking rice like this all my life? <laughs> No, I'm good. Said Future can you make a bigger Dr. Sabre bag? I done flew through mine. About to <laughs> order more. I need a bigger bag than Dr. Sabre herbs. The truth. I told y'all. It's a lot of love going to them herbs. Hey, I might consider. I might need to give me a, a next size, size bag up, up. Okay. Now I'm good because of the state of the economy. We have to be very mindful to eat the best of the best. It's cheaper than a doctor's visit. Do not compromise your body. Yeah. You better speak that, uh, Dwight. That is so true. Don't you compromise like your that. body. I was talking to somebody about that too. They was like, "But isn't eating vegan expensive?" I like, said, "No, no, you get it's, that? no, it's way cheaper than a doctor's visit." So <laughs> I mean, you got to value your life like people value Jordans and like people value leather coats. And how people value certain shoes or uh, Earth Strong outfit, solar return outfit. You got to value your life the same way. Every day is a miracle when we wake up because our systems in our bodies are always compromised by this environment that we live in with these invaders and colonizers always poisoning the earth, poisoning our air, poisoning our food, poisoning our clothes, poisoning everything that we Poison touch. Yes, they lie like everything natural, and you turn it on the back, read the ingredients, and it's got a yellow number five and red number 80 and purple How number so 70. Cyclotriloid. Yeah, stuff that you know ain't real. Troy said, never knew that yourself, L Bay. Bay, be safe with that name, LOL. A lot of BS comes behind it. <laughs> <laughs> now, nah, for real, bro, that's dope. <laughs> <laughs> and the white, yesterday I ate a piece of cod that was supposedly wild caught. I broke out in a rash. Ooh, oh, my goodness. Let me tell y'all, one of my jobs earlier in my 20s, I worked on a fishing, a fishing boat. Oh, yes. And let me tell y'all. He, he was a fish. He worked on the fishing boat. Where you was out there at? I went, we sailed from Los Angeles, from the LA Bay, all the way up to the, uh, right at the base of Alaska and back down. And you would be out there for probably about two months, a month, a month short trip. 60 days. 60 days, long trip, maybe 90 days, depending on 
but like the uh, crab vessels would be out longer. But anyway, it's no regulation on seafood. When seafood is pulled out of the net and dropped into the ship, it's ice on the ship. It's separated. It's ice. And when you pull up to the dock, there are people with different companies that to pick that fish up. There's no regulatory board where you got to go to the marine that way. No, and you marine have fish. Marine authority or nothing. Sometimes they have abscesses on their mouth, especially where oil fields, oil spills have been. They call them dead zones where none was is, is living, none is thriving there. So you be on, even on your navigation, you can't. You just no use to go there because, but it's still affecting the outside life. It's not just in that one spot. It radiates out in this. There's no regulation. So and they just cut that tumor off, but that body has been affected by and it. And I so. had a cousin that worked at a, uh, a fishery that passed away some years back, a few years back. And uh, just from simply the solution that the fish was swimming in. This on the fish farm. In his suit, yeah, he worked at a fish farm. And he was a scientist. You know, he was the one like a janitor that didn't know what he was doing. This was a scientist. And my cousin, uh, Bunny May, uh, you know, rest in power, cub. But it got him and swole his body up, and it was simply from him being exposed to the chemical that the fish are in, that they're breeding the fish in. So Those if it did a human body like that, and, and it's not affecting the fish, if oh my god, no, I'm cool. Yep. I went on Africa if I'm gonna do. Well, I need to say I would be there, pal. With note to self: red shirt, black slacks, green shoes. I love how y'all say my name. People act like it's so difficult to say. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> well, I need up. <laughs> Sango Tumi said, Gunner 2021. Gunner Tastic Voyage. Come on, come on, take a ride. This party of hell and ain't no job. It's live, live, all the way live. Even have to front, don't even have to try. Just drive, drive, slippery slide. It's a gift round of troubles, ain't nine to five. Just sail along. That's what you do. Just sail along. Hey, hey Jam Love family, family, what's up with it? My wife be having me acting so silly, man. I tell you, I'm my aunt, man. Love <laughs> life, baby. You can't Why help I, it. Hola, 2J. Hola, 2J. Oh, Kwame in the house. Saturday born in the house. Hi, Hope. You are both. We are great. We feeling our black tastic selves tonight. The energy is high. Shay says specific requests, comments, or questions. Living my best life in Ghana at gmail.com. Be patient and be respectful. Thank you so much, you love. Appreciate that. Medassi, medassi. Yes, our people are so mindful at all times. I appreciate how y'all take care of us and make sure we don't have to work as hard because it's a load off and we can just focus on our people at all times. We really appreciate everybody that contribute, like our Shay Shiri. What will we do without our Sherry, our Wakanda spirit, Shay in the house? Okay, yourself said, I got you on that at Troy. I've been using this name for 15 years before I knew all the history behind everything. Don't know why I haven't changed it yet. <laughs> you just waiting to get to Africa, that's all. Oh, yeah. Malika, Malika, what's up with you? Yes, I'm coming too. I swear, I just thinking about this 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 morning about that this morning for sure need to master their discipline each one teach one that's all it is that's all it is my grandmother hopped yeah. helped me to activate the charcoal she's a vegan naturopath man that's gone grandmama that's what's up that katumbray stew will have you licking your fingers and elbows yes, yes it are. will it's true i've done it mm-hmm the white said Power, I find my tank is running low. What do you recommend herbals that can take to get more juice in my tank if you know what I'm saying? Superman. Yeah. I'm going to send you a pack of that Superman. Hey, 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 hey. Send you a pack of that Superman. Hey, 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 and look, hey. And then you can go to uh, Dwight if y'all got uh, a Jamaican market there. Go there and get Ginnups. <clears throat> Ginnups or Logan's. And they're little, little uh, they on the vine. You'll find them at like the little uh, fresh markets. I'm trying to think in Atlanta. Well, what would be someplace you find some dinners in Atlanta? Uh, you, you know what? If you can call Seven Under, uh, Dwight Seven, Seven Under, Under might, might have. have they yeah. might have them joints. They call Guinness, but I think they're spelled with a Q. But they uh, look great. They look like little key limes almost, but they got a little strange little. 
flesh in, inside them and they kind of tart, you, sweet and tart at the same you time. You bite them like a hole, like you put your teeth in them to yeah, open them up, and then you pop the seed inside your mouth, eat the, flesh, mouth, from eat the, the flesh around it, and then spit the seed out. Yeah. But that Superman T brother, that's that's the lick right there all day long. Shay said here in Cal Carolinas, they do collard green sandwiches. What? That's like we know we was we had, we had the collard green sandwich. And I started store. making them yeah, when we got here. Yeah, I had that Ooh, we I make a collard green uh <laughs> like a, a slice of vegan field roast barbecue collard green sandwich with some toasted wheat bread. That's we. Yourself said, LOL, get them power. <laughs> <laughs> Yvonne, uh, yo. Yvonne in the house. Yo. You are welcome. Power Future, give me props on some collard greens. Right, some collards. Give me my props. <laughs> 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 I'm a greener. I'm you say. Let me tell you something. I love greens. Me too. Especially now, I got a favorite green. Turnip greens are just my favorites. Cooked with the turnip. Heck, y'all! I'll have all three of my boys at your school, brother Power. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! It's going it's down. Going down. It's going down. I'm gonna teach them uh, weapons and everything. Every belt level, you get a new weapon added on to your skill set. Once you Marty Marcy at the same family. Me who yeah, I am well. Madasi for being here, family. That oh, means thank you. Madassi, yes, come on in, speaking the language, because you Madassi, cannot be Charlie. afraid to speak that language to grow as an integrated African when you repatriate. It makes things more easier. Okay. And people seem to think that, oh, you are. It's like a confirmation. Like, we knew you was one of the, you just, cause you are one of us. You are, we are the same people. Honey B Beauty said, where is Shay? I'm from South Carolina and I have never heard of it. Man. No collard green sandwiches. I'm in South Carolina at the moment, normally in NC, North, North Carolina. Carolina. In Carolinas. Cool goodbye. I like that. Got me want to try that, boy. I have a collard green sandwich. You done already had it. I know. I mean, like right now, I'll try it. <laughs> <laughs> like right now. I emailed a cash out. Let me know if I if I sent enough. I sure will. I'm in South Carolina. Never heard of collard green sandwiches. Yes, you ex Bronxy in the house. The you ex Bronxy. Yes, I've been cutting down on a lot of food. You don't even know what. Real or not, and it's looking like whomever has the control over the food will have stability. That's true. Yep, it's yeah, true. true. My grandmother down in Savannah used to give us liquid asafizida to clean us out. And I got asafizida as well in yep. some of my our herbal combination packs, too. And I remember we used to get some on a I forget the the as a visitor, my mama used to make some up and put it on a spoon and used to have to drink it. Ooh. You quite need to say, ooh. The moment I started speaking fluent tree, ha, I might forget English was my first language. Ha ha ha. Yes. So I say that all the time. I say I'm gonna take English and fold it up in a little box and put it up in the corner. Uh, BB Duro, African herb medicine is the truth. Gone, gonna lock. She said, "A BB Duro." BB Duro. I, I appreciate that. Thank you for that Duro. I knew a BB, but I didn't know Duro. I've heard of it, but I didn't remember it. Sonya. So, so, hey, everybody! Welcome back, Sonya. Honey Bee Beauty said, "Me either." And you expressed Yes. College sandwiches. Very common in, in North Carolina. You can find it sometimes in low country areas in South Carolina. Right. Okay. <laughs> Choice, I know I'm a great wise storyteller because the most have put me through everything but a few years younger and I ain't worked on no damn fishing boat, LOL. <laughs> what you ain't do, man? LOL power is solid. <laughs> I'm telling you, this man has done everything. Yeah, but I done tried some everything. The way of y'all. No fish, no beef, no milk. And that's right. We don't want none of it. 
No, not in Babylon. You cannot even eat none of that. Gunna Locke said, I am plant-based, but that grilled tilapia and gunna can break all rules. <laughs> it's true. Let me tell you something. Miss sure Minnie, Miss Minnie now. Which one is it? Miss Minnie, Minnie's, Minnie's now. Or mine's now. <laughs> it's, it could be, it could go many ways. I like this because every time it come up, I'd be. Miss Minnesota. Pop one. Bam. Got it. Miss Minnie's Snow. Yep. Miss Minnie's Snow to Pop one. Okay. LOL. Y'all silly. We be on here yeah. tripping Miss Minnesota. Okay. Hey, G, the guy. Hey, G, LOL. Hey, I love y'all. What's up, man? <laughs> hey, hey, G. What's up with you? Yeah, heck y'all. Y'all jamming. Invite me to the cookout when you get to Gunner. LOL, <laughs> love y'all. You know all y'all invited. I'm you know it. Tell you, we're going to kick it, man. We're going to drink some of that fresh juice. While I'm thinking about it, I want to go on mention our black book and our black card that we coming up with for our living my best life in Gunner family. So y'all be thinking on it. Make sure you put your name, your YouTube uh, handle. Make sure you have your email in it, your phone number, the businesses that you want to attack when you get to Ghana, uh, any type of trades or any type of experience or expertise that you have, put that in there. So when we get develop our black book, we're going to all have us a little black book carrying our pockets in our purses or whatever, and we're going to have that black card to flash at each other when we meet each other in different places to let us know that we got to take care of each other when we flash that card, okay? So be concentrating on it. Get your ideas together for the card, for the perks, the benefits, all of that. We want to make sure we have us a little membership fee so that when we pass down through different places, you might need somewhere to stay. Don't have no cash in hand. You might be able to flash that black card. Somebody give you, you know what I'm saying, yeah, somewhere to stay for the, for the night or for seven days or something like that. That's what we working on. That's some underground railroad work. All right. Marie said, Quaba family. Yo, Marie. What's up, Marie? LOL, y'all jamming. <laughs> <laughs> Me too, it gonna lock. Okay, we getting there. Energy is high because we moving to Leo season. Aye. Yeah, them Leos are something else, boy. Yes, Leo. <laughs> Sister, how are you, Ed Marie? Can y'all follow me, Dwight, the mentor page? Follow Dwight, Dwight, the mentor. I follow you on uh, Instagram. I see all them movie sets you got ready. Man, Power gonna be coming down there to get with you so we can get this movie together. We got a couple of movie ideas, especially about his life. It's the way he tell them, we gotta go ahead and put that in the movies. <laughs> it's true. The Cal Farmers Market should have Guinness. Look at Sherry. Yeah, oh, the DK Farmers Market. We got to yep. find that junk when I go back down. Malika said, I just love how this be live and y'all just bust out in the song and dance on <laughs> <laughs> sing together. Y'all love is so inspiring. Y'all the lit African cover. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you. Malika. Madase, yo. For real. Sherry said, I look at the bed to check y'all out. Like Sly and the Family Stone said it. <laughs> you caught me smiling again. <laughs> Love you guys. <laughs> Sherry <laughs> snuck out the bed. Snuck out the bed Get back in quick. there. Get yourself back in there, bed. Sherry, where you going? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> A Sakuma Wiki. Sakuma, <laughs> Sakuma Wiki. Oh, man. in Kenya, mm -hmm. Sakuma Wiki. Okay, mm -hmm. Sakuma Wiki in Kenya. My Joe Entertain, any word on the day and time when they will show your movie? Okay, they told us it's going to be on the 7th. Seventh. That's a Friday. I don't yes. know the time in particular yet. August 7th. So we do know the day. Yes, August The 7th. time we don't know. We right. was waiting for the time, but yes, it's on there. So come on, Marcus, meet us. 
My Yo. cousin is excited, y'all. He talking about they got award shows and stuff <laughs> <laughs> lined up. We trying to get at least 10 people so we can buy the VIT, what is it, the VIP group ticket? Yeah, they got that table. table. Yeah, we all can just be together at that joint. Yeah, we can be together all the time. If we need two of the 10 groups, we can do that too. Excuse me. Really? Yes. Shawnee, speak on it. Ginnup. I like them things, boy. Them ginnups is good. In Jamaica, when I go to Jamaica, I get a big bundle of them and, and eat them just all day long. And they seem to do something for my gums, too, for some reason. They good, but they, they seem like they clean my gums or something, too, because my, my I, it's, it's good. Like, my mouth tingles when I eat them. It's real good. T. Royce and my homegirl from the Carolina, she geeches. They eat the same food as Louisiana Creole. Yeah. Sonya says she learning the Hebrew language now. Man, but I folks got some brands. We got some brands on like computers. <laughs> I think that's, that's where the computer like came from. Brain laid out. From yep. Here. Unexposed experience. That I third that emotion on the fish. It's amazing. I ain't gonna. Marty Mark said a body language in Ghana is don't eat with your left hand. Right. When a baby is young, a sock is put over the left hand so the child will not eat with it. Oh, that's how you train the babies not to eat with their left hand. That's what Wow, up. we just always been like, eat with, use your other hand. Yeah. Use your other hand. That's what's Respect up. the culture. That's right, Marty Mark. That's what's <clears> happening. That's what we doing. We love the culture. It's amazing how when you speak the language, when you just try, they it's a God, it's you. a God name just pop out, out of, of nowhere, nowhere and, and just go, look at oh. you and smile. You and, speak the tree. <laughs> you, you want to speak the tree. And they say, oh. it's the same. And you say, hey, yeah, now, this is way. And if you say it wrong, they're going to coach you right there on the spot. They don't, they don't have to know you or nothing like that. Just right there on this man. Look. They be like, Boca Pie, then they go and say something like, they be uh, like, tell you, okay, like, poetry, then, and, da, 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 da. and then they be like, <laughs> you speak, it used to be like, minty tree, could cry, could cry. Like, I speak small, small. <laughs> yeah, but it's like, it's great. It's a great experience to be out in. Cause you automatically look different. Cause we we are different type of African. We African, but we from the diaspora. So Ghanaians, pretty much Africans can figure out where you from from the way you look or whatever. Unless you just fully uh, got full African garb on and you ain't got your mouth open and you look in a certain way, you being still or something, then you might get past it. But most of the time. They can tell. So when you start speaking the language, they be like, oh, they be so proud. It's like, oh, you trying, though. Yeah. You trying. And that's, and so you can't be scared to do it because if that's the way you learn the language. We was watching a video earlier today with uh, Nia Yi. He was interviewing some yeah, people from so Gabon and from where else they was from. Gabon, other was from. They were French speaking countries. Was it Benin? Benin, yeah. Benin, yes. And he was talking to them. And these brothers had been in the country six months. And one was a one was one year, one was six one months. One was you one year, one was six months, and they were speaking fluent English. Because they, they come to, from a Francophone country. Yeah, and they came to Ghana to learn English. So check that out. That that dichotomy out. They right. came to Ghana to learn English. That's crazy. It's really crazy. The white said that Marty is hard because I'm a lefty. Ah. Don't hold that against me. I'll buy you a cocktail in our soup. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to go to the Republic. We're going to be in the Republic and we're going to take care of that. Juanita, English will be irrelevant soon. She sure will. <laughs> so will it will. It just feel good to feel fly. It's just something like, and I always use the word fly because it's just like. That's how African That's my thing. It's just it's I love synonymous it. with just, Africanness. Oh, man. Just speak. You bust out speaking another language that nobody's even heard. Whoa, what is this? Oh, this tree. Oh, this, Ma you know, Kelly this said, greetings, family. My grandfather lived to be 108, eating scotch bunny peppers with what he grew on in his farm in Haiti. Whoa. Man. Honey, hey. Eating them scotch bunny peppers. Keeping that blood flowing. Okay. Spiky blood. What's up, Maul? 
How you doing, Kelly? Kelly? Maude Kelly in the house. I like that. Like you value Jordans. Uh huh. <laughs> you got to value your body the same way. Yes, yeah, specific requests, comments, or questions. Live my best life in Ghana at Gmail. Be patient and be respectful. Love the black book and the black card ideal. Yes. Shay, that comes from your lineage in Sierra Leone. Ha ha ha, right at the white dementia. By the way, I'm a lefty too. <laughs> Y'all gonna have a hard time in Ghana. You're gonna have to gotta put that sock on you the ground. That... Okay, we're gonna tie your left hand behind your back. <laughs> <laughs> UX Bronx said, Love that idea. It's Black coming card. to fruition. Yes, the Black Book concept is great. I know I need everyone in this chat room that started with us so we can organize on the continent. That's right. That's, That's right. right. It's all about consistency. It's about us growing. We building a network, a family, extended family. We're going on to Ghana to build businesses, empires. Okay? Fuck them corporations. <laughs> Fuck them corporations, okay? We going home to build empires like our ancestors did. All we got to do is go back and study what they did. And we know to do all of that evidence that's still here in 2020, that was 10 million and 10,000 and 20,000 years ago and all that stuff, you had to have organization. You had to have trustworthy people. You had to be on one accord. You had to have the same ideology. A whole lot of stuff had to be the same. Shamari said, Future, do you have, or are you writing a cookbook? Because y'all be making me hungry on these lines, talking about all that yummy food. <laughs> I have started on the cookbook. Yep. Man, it's amazing how y'all y'all be speaking stuff. I be working on the cookbook. I've been working for at least a year now. and um, as soon as I feel like I got enough recipes to go ahead and publish the first edition, I will do it. Now I'm good. Hey, we dropping social media out here. Hmm. Don't let me sit up here and do shameless plugs. <laughs> <laughs> no eating flesh in America. Can't trust it. Public enemy voice. Can't trust it. <laughs> I Can't follow trust you, it. Troy said at the white. Can I audition? I have a bit of film background. Honey Bee Beauty. Go, oh, Honey Bee Beauty. Yeah, you can audition. We're going to get these movies rolling over and go, because it's going to be so many diasporans in Africa. We got to do it the way we're accustomed to. We can build networks of people. Look, let me tell you something. A Ghana film company with the, the, the Ghanaians. As your, your your cameraman and your production we crew, we, we did. did that. And when I tell, tell you, you, it was the best experience. It was one of the best experience in our life. Professionalism. I mean, taking it to the to the to the maximum every time they showed up. Mm -hmm. I had a ball them 21 days we was over there filming that movie. That was I last July. This ball. time last year. Yourself, L. Bay Bay says, shoot, I can write a movie script of my life. It would be crazy, but a great <laughs> movie, no doubt. And that's what we want. We yeah, want to yeah. go to we want to go to Ghana and do a diaspora film company, film festival, all of that. Where we have continental Africans that live abroad. We can, you know what I'm saying? We can all come together and bring that experience. It can just be a diaspora experience or everything we went through till we got home to the land of our ancestors. Okay. And then we're going to tell that story, and that's going to make history. It's going to be our story, though. Shoot. Yes, that's awesome. I need y'all to bust out in that Marvin Gaye song singing, Keep on dancing, got, got to, to give, give it up. up. Keep, Keep on dancing. dancing. Got to come out and party. Woo! Oh. But hey, look! <laughs> you gonna make us turn the radio on in here? I got myself together, baby. Yeah, all right. Mm. Oh, hey, man! I'm like, <laughs> I got the best movie I did ever. <laughs> Create a movie about an African American with Patrice to Ghana. Boom! Coming to Africa. <laughs> that is the movie that Power Neal just did. So you right on point now, good. <laughs> 
Hello, family. It's Tina. Glad to catch the live. What's up? Hey, Tina. Tina up in here. Tina up in here. Blessing, highly favored. Yes, because Africa gas out on you, Tina. And Africans, too. <laughs> we are ready to go. Yourself said, yes, exactly. No, I'm good, but show everything that leads up to repatriation and the process. Yes, the power said, uh, y Yvonne said, the powers that be want you to think that it's more expensive to be vegan so you will continue to eat disease rotten flesh while they get rich on you. Now, that's the truth. That is the absolute truth. Now, I'm good, said it yourself, L. Bay. Exactly like them devils doing mischievous things. And then your turning point was Trayvon Martin's decision. And you said, fuck this. I'm out. Okay. Laughing my butt off, Sonya. <laughs> D-White, I just got him subscribed to my brother. What we calling this movie? Uh, we making LOL. <laughs> we going to figure <laughs> it out. <laughs> Come on with him. Wow, so on point and on good. And show the struggle of trying to do the right thing as black men in America and how the system doesn't work for the masses of black men. Coming to Africa is the movie. That's the movie they just did. And everybody's talking about it. That's crazy. That means we is on point. Sean Mariah said, the way y'all breaking my heart, no soy. And now, no fish. Uh, just wait till you get to Africa. Just wait till you get to Africa. Wait till you get to Africa. Because I'm going to tell y'all, because of we our, you, the bro. way we've been raised up and uh, we've been living and eating so uh, against our natural selves till some of us in our, that, that eat have to take fish for protein to keep your body on point. Sometimes you have to eat fish every now and again. When your body calls for certain things, you have to eat it and you have to continue to use your herbs, your cleansing and stuff like that because it, it's um in Ghana, there's protein, there's this, there's that and the other, but it's sometimes you don't have access to that stuff. You have to have what you need at that point in time. So always remember, yes, stay on your square. But when your body calls for certain thing and you seem like you're getting ill or you losing too much weight or you got too much, you know what I'm saying? You noticing a whole lot of changes in your body that ain't all the best. Then you check out what it is and 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 go back, retract. Hmm. So you might have to eat some fish every now and again. Hit that like button, 49 in the chat and 43 likes. Come on, y'all now. The Great Migration, LOL, and the Rise of the Black Messiah. Them some good names. But we got coming to Africa, so them, but that's <laughs> a even a better name, ain't it? Talk the shit, future. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. <laughs> yourself. No, I'm good, said yourself. Yes, that's the most. Like Future just said, we can talk about the corporation and how you have to assimilate. I think we should call it, it's time to go home. Billy. Yes. I need that cookbook, Future. I got it. It's coming, Quanita. It's coming. Or oh, the Great Awakening. And now I'm good. Yourself, L. Bay. Bay, what about the Great Awakening? It's time to go home. That's a <laughs> nice, that's a good one, too. Latanya Palmer. So That's a fine. beautiful picture of uh, Dr. Francis Chris Wilson you got on your profile. What's up, Latonya? <laughs> Greetings. Welcome, my Kwaba sister. Yeah. Hope you're doing good. Welcome to the live. Now, good. What they? What that movie about? Said, That's what, That's they, what move. they move about. That's what they move about. It sure is. Yeah. The wife said, "Wow, future said that corporate." I said. Fuck the corporations. That's how they do. That's what they say about us. Okay, okay. LOL. I can work with that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Hey. I'm on it. On that, yes. Jam on it. <laughs> Jam on it. <laughs> the day we all speak our language together, ancestors will do this for you. Thank you. See? Yes. Mm -hmm. Maybe make it part two, LOL. Come on with it. Hey Tina, cousin, writing it already. We all got. I got to introduce Anwar to you, Dwight, 
Uh, y'all have got to sit down and talk, especially at this time uh, while all the stuff is going on. It's time to, you know, be, I don't know if what y'all schedule it like, but I got to make that happen because there's a, that's a necessity that needs to happen. My shoe for my eyes say, greetings, power and future. We must stop meeting at these times as it is 5, 11 a.m. <laughs> in the UK. I'm so sorry, my shoe, but that's why oh, I do one shoe, in the morning too. Man. We so sorry, but we had to get, we be trying to get two in in a day and this is like the only, this is our best time. So I'm sorry to wake you up, but we need you. So make a Troy, what is it? Come on in and just, just stay <laughs> woke as long. Have a, have have some some Murgatroy. Who is Murgatroy? <laughs> I just saw what he do is have a Murgatroy. Who is some Murgatroy? <laughs> Marty Mark. No, I'm good. Want to know where you live at in now, uh, Ghana, if you don't mind me asking. And Kwanita said, I am subscribed. Don't play with it. Thank y'all. No problem. Yeah, so welcome. I have to keep eating because when I slow down, I lose weight fast. I don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> so he said, I just can't eat this meat anymore, but my fish, I need. Nothing else tastes the same. I just can't do it. Help me, please. Help me, please. Yep. Eat a lot of mushrooms. Mushrooms. We eat plenty of mushrooms, like beans, I need to go ahead and make some mushrooms peas, right now. Black eyed peas. Greens, greens, uh, kale, stuff. kales in all fashions. Cooked kale, seasoned kale, raw kale, all kinds of kale. Shay at living my best life and gonna locks at the local market and gonna there are these little dark brown or black balls that are vegan protein. It looks like clay. What is it called? Uh, it might be soya chunks. No, it she is. said black balls. Oh, black balls. Oh, you said some little black balls she at the market. Latanya, enjoying the live. And we join you too. We enjoy you. I was a vegan, then a vegetarian, then a pescatarian, then I'm a mess. Metasaurus. Metasaurus. I got to get back to the doctor to the say the truth. <laughs> you sure do now good. Yum. <laughs> you ex Brunt said. Top Cat cartoon, Heaven's to Mercator. Top Cat, yeah. Heaven's to Mercator. <laughs> Stop saying black balls. <laughs> Heaven to make <Mercury> joy. <laughs> yes. So y'all look. Cartoons. I'm telling y'all, listen to me. Don't be afraid to use the language because you're going to hear the language around you all the time. And it's going to make you excited as you study the language and you start hearing words and figuring out what people are talking about. That's when you know. Oh, oh, Bedro. <laughs> Why you out there, Bedro? <laughs> Bedro. I'm just going to teach y'all this right quick. Oh, my God. I'm going to teach me this. <laughs> Bedro is dog head. <laughs> so we were trying to learn. This is how silly we were when we first got there. We were trying to learn how to check and treat. Oh, God, we didn't care what language you were. We just trying to learn how to change. So, our Uncle T. <laughs> so, Uncle T came up with these words. Bancho is dog head. And so, you know, we had this song, Project Pet came. Dwight Project Pet came up with the chicken head. Remember chicken head song? So, when you call somebody a chicken head and tree, it's a cuckoo tree. <laughs> a cuckoo tree. 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 <laughs> we found out all the words we could to oh, check folks. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This last one, boy, we learned when we was in Ghana, we were saying when we was it? getting cut off, baby. Come folks crazy. It was a snail head or what was it? <laughs> <laughs> what was it? It was about two quarters. I took the title of something. I wish he was on here. Oh, Y'all be man. tripping, man. Oh, wait. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Ooh. So, what time you guys have there? It's 11 17 p.m. here. Same time here. Yep. Same time here. What are those uh, <laughs> little black or brown balls? They look like clay. What are they called at the market? Gonna like get it right there. I think that's made from roasted corn called Mamu. Mamu. 
New Ningo, a fishing village. New Ningo, we know where New Ningo is. Yeah, we know exactly where that is. Yourself say, yeah, I remember that. Yup, on Sunday morning yeah, cartoon. Yeah. Nice. New Ningo is nice. Uh -huh. <laughs> Too funny. <laughs> and wait a minute, it's another one. A boy, boy, a boy, a boy, beast. Uh, hold on, hold on. Go back to beast. Go back to your country. Hold on. It's gonna come to me. Well, who yeah, boy? <laughs> I he had to get it out. You had to get it. I had to think it all at one time. It's like beast, go back to your country. So we was learning all these things. This one we was running to the missionary <laughs> doing like the European missionaries walking all everywhere the with them fives and them little you know the ones that be uh the little house on the prairie people? They be over there doing the little thing over there too. That was crazy. That who yeah boy. Ah ah that's how they go. Oh, uh, who's your boy? Oh, uh, who's your boy? Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> and what's the other one? Uh, uh -huh. M two two three. M two two three. Mosquito, Mosquito head. head. <laughs> <laughs> M two two three. Oh my goodness, oh, my we goodness. learned some some more. What's some more tree we learned? Oh my goodness. Have you been to Prom Prom? Yes. yes. Somebody tried to sell us some land on the salt flat in Prom Prom. <laughs> Sherry said, no, I'm good. You sound like me. I never went back to beef before, but I knew I eat certain fish and chicken once in a while. Ooh, Sherry, I got to tell you a story about the chicken. I got Ooh, my tip. Honey Bee Beauty, I have to say good night for now. It's after midnight here, and I have to work in a few hours. I have enjoyed this live. <laughs> Blessings to you all. Hi, honey Bee Beauty. Hi, honey Bee. Yes, later. Chill on out. Not yet. LOL, no, I'm good. Good, straight up. Yeah, look, Sherry, so I know you just said I don't never fish no store. So look, when I got out of the plane, I had ate chicken in about six years. Prom Prom is the new black America. You didn't know, LOL. I got off the plane and seen this dude grilling that chicken across the street. They had chicken on a stick with them real chickens running around. I asked <laughs> that man, I said, is this the chicken? He's like, oh, yes, my brother. This is African chicken. You should take one. Now, I ain't had chicken in six years. Oh, I got a chicken on the street. I ate that chicken, and it shut my... Let me tell you something. I heard the key lock turn in my bowels. <laughs> that says there's nothing coming out of here. You ain't ate no meat in six years. You ain't no nothing in six years. And you gonna jam a chicken on the stick? We gonna teach you. When I say I was so constipated till I was crying, I wanted to get it out so bad. I was like, baby, just this is our first trip. I don't know nothing about going no herbs or none of that to go get. No, nothing. I don't know nothing. That's my first time here with the locked up bowels. That was horrible. Horrible. That was a rap on that. Malika said, I be feeling like a queen boss walking down the street singing my stone boy. I don't know what he's saying, but I be singing my African words and feeling great. I want to jump up in the street. I'm going to <laughs> Africa. <laughs> Yeah, Sonny said, yeah. you two always make my day. Future keep me rolling. If I don't smile all day, I got to do it. It's tuned in <laughs> to you guys. The gen energy is off the chain. That's what's up. <laughs> but that's it. Yo, LOL. Whoa, hell, boy. Yeah, boy. You are a beast. beast. Uh-huh. Whoa, hell, right, boy. boy. Thank you, Uriah. <laughs> oh, <boy. laughs> I told y'all, we've been learning, man. No, I'm good. El El Pal, I remember when I first had me for the first time in 10 years, I was on that tour to praying to the ancestors. <laughs> Please, y'all, let this come out of me. I won't do this no more. I promise. Please. <laughs> you be begging it. <laughs> that look like some classical. Oh, my God. Uh, classical black, uh, <laughs> what you call it? Uh, What's the, uh, the black exploitation movie? <laughs> <laughs> Please! Uh, hey, look, it was some of the shake. best. Ah! <laughs> oh, I just want to get it out. <laughs> <laughs> that's how I feel that day. The chicken. Oh, my Lord, God, it's horrible, awesome. baby. Oh, oh, you just had to, you got to stay away from that meat. Especially when you stop eating, it. you can't do your body like that. Just feel like somebody trying to walk out of me. <laughs>
<laughs> yep, I got like that when I was a vegetarian for six and a half years. And then when I was in a truck driving a cab, that started about eating meat and my stomach hurt it for about a month. Just forcing it. Oh, God. The kind of poop session you got to take all your clothes what? off and you be hot. You be hot. Have a hot cold flash, you be sweating. <laughs> <laughs> then you get cold. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's the worst. I can't stand the smell of hamburgers on the grill, you ain't once to say. <laughs> Even if mama folk, my husband thinks it's a good idea to leave me and the kids in Africa while he goes back to the States to make that paper for that mini mansion. What do you think? I mean, you'll be safe. You'll be safe, but I, I couldn't be away from mine like that. But some people can do it. Yeah, You'll I'd be fine. That. You'll be safe. You'll be fine. We'll be there with you, so hey. Because it really won't take no probably about four or five checks, to be honest with you. Yep. <laughs> Ellie said, have you heard of Tabitha Brown? She is vegan and her cooking is excellent. She has a YouTube channel. Tabitha Brown. I think we have oh, watched her. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. I think so, yeah. Power, chicken is horrible. We definitely shouldn't eat chicken. Oh, you you, you ain't got to tell me. Ma Kelly said, y'all got me crying. <laughs> <laughs> See, every day that chicken stood up and walked out my colon. Troy said, have you uh, on that James Brown, LOL, cape and all? Please, 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 Man, please, what? please, please, please. You had that chicken, cape on. please go. <laughs> Please, please, please. Can't hey, stand fine. the smell of grilled meat. Never ate meat. Oh, that's good. It man. sure that's is. So that is awesome. That's so good. That is so good. Oh, you my God. down here with us. That's all you smell. And let me tell you something. That, that used to be a stereotype. Negroes is always good. That's all they do is barbecue. And that's, they don't do this. They barbecue, barbecue, barbecue. Let me tell you something. In Ghana and Africa, period, just an African thing, man, because it's going to be some. On the grill all day long in any African country you go to, from chicken to fish to snails to, to vegan kebabs everywhere. Because we don't know no better, Yvonne. We don't know no better. We eat like we was taught. That's right. And until we learn better. And sometimes we think we be disrespecting folks' memory by not eating the same stuff that they did. They don't want them. They don't want us to keep making the same, same mistakes. mistakes. They That's true. Yeah. We just got to learn better and do better. We can't be hard on ourselves. It's a day to day process and we just got to do better when yeah. we learn better. We That's owe all. it to, we owe it to our folks, our ancestors to yes. learn better and do better. We, we can't be like, man, we're good enough for my grandma. It's good <laughs> enough for me. Man, look, your grandma was born in 1929, man. Come on now. It's 2020. We got to do something better for grandma legacy, man. Come on now. No, I'm good. Say, well, I'm going to tell you a stereotype that I don't care if it's one watermelon. Y'all crazy. If y'all don't like no watermelon, I will fulfill that. That is a, a real treat for me <laughs> I'm to trying eat watermelon. Some cold watermelon. It's like I got oh some ice cold God. water. Oh. Then I ran up on the yellow meat watermelon. I'm going, I'm, when I get up tomorrow, I'm going down there to the farmers on a third and holler at them because them brothers be down there come up from Mississippi with that fresh watermelon. And you know it's theirs because they pull it right out the pad. They ask them for go, uh, uh, Jimmy Lee, get get y'all, get bro, uh, one of them. And Jimmy Lee go there and slap that thing. It sound like the top of a kente or like a drum. Yes, Donna likes that. I love to see the watermelon. The yellow ones are so yes, sweet. Yes, this is my first These time eating the ones we've been eating lately. That's the first. This is my first time eating Lucy's. We had two in the past mm -hmm. two weeks, and it was my first time, and it was great. I love watermelon. I don't want to put my husband on that watermelon. Yeah, he didn't eat, eat watermelon, watermelon like that until we got together. And I had, I cold, had to have me some cold watermelon. Because most people I knew would eat watermelon room temperature, and it just made me kind of nauseated at first. Yep. Never... Shay said watermelon is stigmatized specifically because it's one of the healthiest foods you can eat. Yes, it is. Yep. It's full of water, just like our bodies yep. Hydrate are. you up. No, I'm good, said. Ooh, <laughs> LOL. Uh uh. <laughs> Jimmy Lee. <laughs> Watermelon lemonade tastes Man, like God made. But oh, Troy, for to make that to my morning. <laughs> Single Tumbi said, "Power them yellow watermelons are addictive." Yes, sir. I'm telling you. Yes, they are. Orange meat is good too. Orange meat. You as Bronson, I ain't never seen no orange meat watermelon. What? 
It's a Whole Foods all by itself. It really is. Go on, Shay. Watermelon really soup is. is awesome. Watermelon soup? Come on now. I can't so eat it. Y'all trying it now. I'm going to try it. Where is that? I don't want no watermelon soup. See, it's just like how I thought about uh, peanut butter soup. When I first heard about peanut butter soup, I was like, how you going to make some soup out of peanut butter? I don't want no damn peanut butter. Then when I tasted it, it didn't taste nothing like peanut butter. Ground up soup. You okay. daggone right. God made that watermelon for us. That's why the folks be so jealous of us, man. They got watermelons and, and oranges that's green and lemons. That, come on, man. Cashews. They got nuts and apples on the thing. And you ate bronzy. You ain't never had seafood either. It's my shoe for watermelon. <laughs> Yes, pickle sweet watermelon rhyme, yummy. Oh, say that's something that North Carolina oh, stuff. Send no. me a child that say. No. Wait, what in the world is watermelon <laughs> soup? That's like <laughs> butternut soup. No, I'm good. Now we actually <laughs> had some butternut squash soup. Oh, and it was fine. Now that's good. It was fine. Yes, watermelon and lemonade is the bomb. Yes, my goodness, that's Ooh, my a good goodness. thing I'm we need to try. Said that I got my fruit is outside. outside. They got the orange meat watermelon in Houston and Louisiana. What? Blessed and highly favored. Are you guys currently in Ghana or in the States? We as we is in the States, but we all headed to Ghana and Africa. Period. Period. Mommy Wata is so awesome. I definitely am one of her children. <laughs> okay, for sure. When I see watermelon in Ghana, I'm going to lose my sh. I love watermelon. I can't eat seedless, though. I like the yellow meat watermelon as well. Ghana has watermelon on deck. Okay, they jealous of us because we have soul. And spirit. They mad because they ain't got no spirit. <laughs> the white says, Sherry, Trinity's use a lot of herbs. Lemon, garlic, wine, ginger, and turmeric is in almost every meal. Wow. Yvonne said, I do a watermelon detox. And yes, watermelon soup is delicious. Explain the watermelon soup. I just can't imagine watermelon soup. Yes, lemonade is the bomb. I drink lemonade with agave like every day. I don't use white sugar no more. Me too. I have used white sugar in so long. I love that Dr. Sabi introduced us to agave. Okay. Mint, watermelon, lime, cardamom, and mangoes. What? Dang, that sound good. Uh, U.S. Brunson? Oh. Sherry, I've never seen a yellow watermelon in NYC. Everything that moves have a spirit, but the original people have souls. White people don't have no spirit. I can tell you that. They not everything either. Them is a species or something. That's why they gave us that fake white Jesus, because they did not have spirit. They had to make up something and put it in a book. Our spirit and what we represent does not go in a book. It cannot go there. OK, it can be mentored and it can be, you know, it can be polished by a book of knowledge that is in, in African centeredness. But other than that, no, I should be training then because that's what I cook with all the time. Yep. Butternut. Anything is good. I make butternut squash pie. It's like sweet potato pie but healthier because dr saber said said that sweet potatoes are not alkaline okay so i try my best to use alkaline everything and i make a butternut squash pie just like sweet potato pie you will swear up and down you was eating sweet potato pie i was vegan in college i survived just fine it was definitely cheaper than buying me to cook yeah, that's why I don't understand why people be saying that. Marty Mar said, juice the watermelon and the rind. The rind is where the real benefits lie. That's true. Ghana is watermelon all over the place. It's like fruit heaven. It's true. That's true. That's true, Mashufa. The white boy on stick is per brother a badele kambon. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, a past one. 
Watermelon man on Bronxner Boulevard in the Bronx sells yellow me watermelon. What? My sister used to live in New Jersey. She had a hard time. Sister Tommy, she used to live in New Jersey. She used to have a hard time finding them watermelons. Keith worked on a fishing boat in D.C. in college. Wow. What? <laughs> STJ said, LOL, like Rick from Bag, he calls them devils. The caucasity of them Neanderthals is overwhelming. You need some watermelon to calm your spirit. <laughs> caucasity. Yourself, El Bebe, I heard a butternut pie. I just never had it, though. That's what's up. Well, look, I'm you gonna try mine because I make some. We gonna bring some to the thing thing, okay? Now I'm good. Said so back in the day, I had to get real creative being a vegan. Now they have all sorts of stuff and all sorts of nice recipes, but my butt was eating twigs and grapes. <laughs> but now you can eat a whole lot more. I make butternut squash mash. Yes, and I had that too. That's delicious. And I make butternut squash cheese. And that's what I use in my lasagna. And I can make some cashew nut cheese. But every, some people are not, I mean, some people are allergic to, to nuts. So I try to stay away from foods that may have allergic reaction. Because when I feed people, I want to feed everybody. Okay. Sango Tumbi said purple sweet potato is good. <laughs> Purple sweet potato. Now, Ghana has their own sweet potato, but it's white. Marty Marsh said, pure lemon. I did juice a half of lemon and three or four apples. No sugar or ice needed. Lemon and apples are cold from the refrigerator. That's a damn good idea. But we got to try some lemonade and apple juice mixed together. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds real good. I can't find purple sweet potato nowhere. Quanita said. Green season is a must. Indians cook with madras turmeric a lot. Have anyone in the chat ever had a fish farm? I'm trying to figure out how to cut the cost of feeding. Them fish farms are dangerous. Uh, but we do know somebody that had one. Yeah, y'all never got one. But I'm just, if you use natural stuff for your fish farm, but I don't know how that would work. Yeah, they got a, uh, they got a natural way in Ghana. Yeah, they got a natural fish farm. Y'all never got one. It's in the river. Okay, yeah, it's located in the river. They got a fish farm, but they use the river to do their fish farm. So, but uh, I have to ask her what is it they use to feed the uh, fish with, though. I have to ask her yourself. And make sure you give us a call in the AM sometime tomorrow, please. Let's go back up here. You don't cook the watermelon. You just juice it and drink it, and it's called watermelon soup. Oh, okay. Well, shoot. I've had this several times. We just call it watermelon juice. Y'all should open up a vegan vegetarian restaurant in Ghana or a stop and shop that plant-based. Oh, yeah. We going to have our food truck there, our vegan food truck. Well, I need a purple sweet potatoes in the NC, North Carolina. SCJ said, ever since I moved back to the Northeast, I have not seen any seeded watermelon. Wow. Yeah, I'm going to need a copy of that cookbook, sister. <laughs> I'm working on it, Sonya. Mm -hmm. Sherry said, U.S. Bronx, I'm in the heights of the edge cone side. Bronkner is too far for me, I think. Dwight said, future. How do you like that fufu there? I had it in Senegal and I wasn't impressed at all. <laughs> I can't do this to just put something in your mouth and swallow it. I just can't. My throat, my throat, my throat don't let me do stuff like that. My, my throat won't let me. Now I'm good. So I love turmeric curry and garlic. I cook with that pretty much with everything. Mm hmm. Now I'm good, company. said it, Dwight. This is terrible, but I haven't had good food food yet. So therefore, right now, I don't like it. I tried it one time, and I have never touched it ever again. That's when we first lived in Ghana. So that was many years ago. I just can't do the texture of food food. 
Okay, I will for sure. I really appreciate y'all. We appreciate you too. We was trying to get to you earlier. We got that email. Joy said, no, I'm good with everything. Sherry said, you got to burn the curry to get it right. I prefer mm -hmm. Chief brand. <laughs> Yo. You ain't sponsored. You be, you be getting creative as heck in the kitchen, don't you? Shoot your head. U.S. Brun and U.S. Brunson. Yes, Sherry, I love. What is that? Jaipur or roti? And roti. Jaipur and roti. What is that, uh, Dwight? It's Jaipur. in the blood. Spicy. Jaipur. That sounds good in the mug. Yeah. It's just a trip. Sometimes, some of you just say some stuff. I'm like, ooh, that sounds good. What is that? <laughs> Well, y'all, it's been a ball. Fufu ain't my speed either. My cousin, old man from Nigeria, he used to keep me a lot as a kid. I liked everything but fish heads and fufu. Bam! You hit it right on the nail, right on the head, right there, T. Roy. I had my homeboy in uh in uh in Jamaica. He <laughs> took us to the little restaurant, man. He got Escobie fish. Man, you see me bit down that fish head, man. I said, "God damn, what you doing?" He's like, "What? What? What?" Oh, we eat fish and the whole time he talking, he chewing that fish and I'm like, oh, bro. <laughs> oh. Family, please study proper food. Combining is very important for health. The wrong combination of food will ferment in your colon and cause colon cancer. Sure is. Thank you, Yvonne. Y'all making me hungry, Mashufa said. You sure did, Troy. Ain't nobody got time for that. No, I'm good, said. LOS, no fish heads. No fish heads. All right, y'all. We love y'all. We're going to get up out of here so we can have us a nice, productive day tomorrow. We love y'all much. It's been a ball as usual. Make sure that you stay focused. Keep your mind straight, African centered. We going up and we on our way out of here. Okay. Up and out. Uh, just like that. Up and out. That's gone away. Okay. We had it up and out. <laughs> but yeah, we love y'all. We love y'all. This is it very important. I ain't never had it. I seen it. They make it. They make it they though. Be eating the hell out of it too. Big crazy life, family. <laughs> yeah, all day. Peace out. Much love to everybody. I would not eat any fruits without seeds. Watermelon cucumbers, they said without seeds, is a European concept. Exactly. Yes, it is. Okay, I'm going to try and get some rest also. You said I'm going to hit you up tomorrow. Yeah, hit us up. Peace, fam. Peace, Quanigo. All right, y'all. We love y'all. Right, Much love and peace up and now. Y'all have a good evening and a good morning, too. Peace.